Hi guys, my name is Kat, I'm a California CPA and in this video I'll show you how to enter W2 in a Drake tax software. Uh, so let me switch to my computer to show you how to enter W2 in Drake. Uh, so I'm honestly like a big fan of Drake, I think it's pretty easy to use. Uh, so here we have a data entry, after you open the tax return we see all the uh, sections where we can enter all the information. If you would like to go uh, view a form or um, see 1040 or any other form, we go to view and print. And here to enter uh, any information, we kind of like go through those sections like general income, uh, which is basically for um, Schedule C, Schedule E, K1 income, adjustments, credits, um, healthcare, all these kind of things are right here. So to enter wages, we go under wages. And what we need to enter is to enter EIN. And I'll show it on an example. Um, enter EIN, employer's name, street address, city, uh, state, all these things goes here. And if you didn't enter any of it, it just kind of like doesn't let you close the screen. So it's pretty straightforward. And let's, let me enter, I'm sorry. Let me enter the wages. So let's pretend there is a 50K of wages. And as you see, social security and Medicare, I'll calculate it itself. So we want to make sure that we enter correct social security wages in Medicare because it calculates the taxes here and double check them according to the form. I'll enter federal taxes. Uh, for state, we do enter state here. So let's say I want to enter California. Here I enter state ID. Wages already, uh, I think it transferred from box one. State tax. Here's localities that we can enter. So for California, it's usually California SDA. And it's, let's do whatever, 890. Oops, sorry. And let's see what else is interesting here. So yeah, if you want to add more state sourced uh, wages or state tax withholdings, we can go in here and that's pretty easy to do. Here is their employee name. So it just, if it's different from box one, taxpayer, you can choose if it's taxpayer or a spouse right here. So that's kind of like how this tax software works. It's pretty straightforward. After we enter um, uh, W2, we can recalculate. I'm sorry, I just, I need to move myself, I guess, to do it. Um, yeah, so we just close W2 and then it should show up under view print forms. Hope that was helpful, thank you. I hope you found my video helpful. Uh, if you want to learn more about me and what I do, please go to my website, remotecpainla.com and please subscribe to my channel. It means still a lot to me when people comment or subscribe to my channel. That makes me want to continue and record more videos. Thank you and have a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye.